So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create this dinosaur and how to create this elephant. So let's go ahead and get started. So to create the dinosaur, what we're going to need is a toilet paper tube, something to draw with. We will need uh, um, some scissors and some things to color in with later on. So the first thing I'm going to do is flatten my uh, toilet paper tube. After I have flattened it, I'm going to take what I have to draw with, a, a marker or a pencil, and I'm going to draw, I'm going to start at the bottom. I'm going to draw this kind of curved line, curved line on both sides coming in. We're going to be starting with the legs of our dinosaur. Then what we're going to do is draw a vertical line. We're going to leave a space, then we're going to draw a horizontal line and then a vertical line down. So it kind of creates this little box. All right, so that's the first step to create our dinosaur. The next step of what we're going to do is the tail. So we're going to come up towards the top. We're gonna to leave a space and then start and make this diagonal line. Then we're gonna make a horizontal line across, but not all the way, leave a space. From there, we create a diagonal line up, and then we leave a space to create the head of our dinosaur. So a curved line all the way to the top. Now, it's time to start cutting out these pieces. I'm going to be going through both sides of my toilet paper roll as I cut out these little pieces. Now that my dinosaur is cut out, I'm going to open, I'm gonna to go to the sides and push open. So it goes back to that tube uh, form. And then I'm going to push down the tail, I'm gonna pull, uh, pull it down, I guess, and to shape it. And then I'm going to go to the top where that little uh, round part is. I'm gonna uh, fold that down to create the head. And look at that, we can start seeing that we're having a dinosaur. So after we have folded down the tail and the head, now we can start adding in those details, coloring it in and making it look awesome. Alright, so now we're going to do the elephant. So we're going to use the same materials that we use for our dinosaur. We're going to start using uh, the toilet paper tube. We're going to flatten it just like how we did with the dinosaur. And once that is done, we are going to start drawing. So grab whatever you're going to draw with. We're going to start with kind of like a rainbow shape. At the bottom, we're going to start with the elephant uh, legs. Then what we're going to do is come from the corner and we're going to make a diagonal line up. This is going to be um, where the trunk is going to go for our elephant. Then on the other side, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to start from the corner and make a diagonal line up. That's going to be the elephant's tail. 
All right, now we're going to come to the top. We're gonna to start with like a curved line at that corner, on the right corner. Curve it, then we're gonna curve it all the way around to the other side. Nice big curve. Where that curve ends on that toilet paper tube, we're going to make kind of like another curved line for the elephant ear. Now it's time to cut. We're gonna cut through both sides um, wherever we drew a line. So now we're ready to open up our elephant. So we're just gonna push the, the sides open and now I'm going to take where the trunk is. I'm gonna pull that out and uh, shape it up. Pull out the ears a little bit and the tail. I can go ahead, um, I must have miscut that. So I'm just going to cut that real quick. There we go. And now I'm going to get the tail out and there we go. We are starting to see our elephant. Um, if the ears did not come out exactly how you wish, um, I needed to adjust mine a little bit. So you'll see that I will cut them uh, and shape them into the way that I want them exactly. So you can add all the details that you would like now. So I added some eyes and now I'm going to color in my elephant with some markers. Um, again, you can color in however you wish if you've got paints or crayons or color pencils, whatever you've got, it will work. So yeah, that's about it. Have fun creating.